Well, let's take a look at uh, factorials first. Um, we want to find like 3 factorial. Well, on your on Excel, you do equals, fact, F-A-C-T, beginning parentheses, then 3, and then close parentheses, and then enter. And that gives you 3 factorial. And if I wanted 7 factorial, I'd do equals, fact, beginning parentheses, 7, close parentheses. Now, that's uh, factorial. Now, let's look at combination. And combination is this form out of uh, 10, pick 3, for example. Um, combination order doesn't matter. This is where um, uh, we got ten people. We're picking three to be representatives. It doesn't matter whether you pick first or third. You're still just a representative. Now for combination, you do equals C O M B I N. Beginning parentheses and then ten comma then number chosen, which would be three, and then close parentheses and then enter. Now let's say out of um, 20, I'm going to pick 4, and order matters. i got four positions I'm going to pick out of 20 people. Uh, president, Vice President, Treasurer, Secretary. Well, if you picked uh, to be President versus Secretary, those are two different positions. So definitely order matters. So I'll do equals. Permutation is order matters. So per, permut, uh, P-E-R-M-U-T. -E Beginning parentheses, 20, comma, 4, close parentheses. And that would give us our permutation. So that's how you do factorial, combination, and permutation.